Hello everybody, my name is Renekin and uh, welcome to my Dark Souls 1 non-gimmick run. Um, I've decided to do a non-gimmick run because the last days I have quite few time and I cannot do the Night of the Sheep because it needs too much cutting etc. And since I am way faster with episodes and creating episodes, if I do a normal run because like I don't need half an hour what it feels like to get to the um, for example to the Taurus demon and then die horribly and do it again um, since at the moment work is eating so much time I will do it just a way well quite a normal run and I will do the deprived again um, take a gift this time I take uh, do I take the master key because it's fucking easy to play with the master key no I take no not average we just take face etc doesn't matter later on it is covered anyways is it the Tora no we'll let's take the sh Short hair or the swept back hair? Let's take the swept back. Take the gold hair color and go to customize. Um, customize here. Eyes. I want to have normal eyes. The green must shine more and the blue must get out of there entirely and we need more red. Yeah, that's more my green. So and we can start our game. Uh, so I'm going to do this one. This will be easy. Um, I will skip every cutscene now to the point of uh, well to the point of where I am at the Black Knight again because again this will take less time yada 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 so we're at the cells again going to slaughter this arsehole going further going to slaughter him Um, so basically the problem with the gimmick run is uh, if I would have a more damaged gimmick run which would be for example what I had in plan was a demon hunter run like double crossbows um, that would be eventually uh, maybe faster but with a shield like one episode is 20 minutes for you is one hour of recording for me because sometimes I have to cut because you don't want to see me killing the same five follows over and over again and then getting a cheap death. Uh, that's no fun at all. Right, guys? So, we're gonna steamroll here. Ah, it doesn't open from this side. Right. Um, you can actually kill the demon right now. By the way, I did this on uh, my duelist run. I took the fire bombs and tried it and to get his club as a weapon. But we're not going to do that. Fuck you. Um, gonna light that bonfire. Gonna rest because who knows? Maybe I die to cheap hollow. <laughs> no fucking no. Plank shield. Equip the plank shield. It's stupid to not equip the plank shield as a weapon. Seriously, we get the club here. Fuck you. Weapon switching. Club, would you please fuck off of my screen? Thank you. Thank you. Dankeschön. So... Traverse through the light. Let's meet Oscar again, who saved us at the beginning. But first of all, oh! 
It's me every time! <laughs> every fucking time! Ah. Uh, okay. Open the door. Getting through there. Resting at the bonfire. Keeping the bonfire. <laughs> For some of you, that may seem boring, but I said a year, the episodes will be quite faster. The cutting will take seconds, literally. Oh, you. You're now hollow. Thank goodness. I'm done for, I'm afraid. I'll die soon, then lose my sanity. I wish to ask something of you. You and I were both undead. Okay. Regrettably, I have failed in my mission. But perhaps you can keep the torch lit. There is an old saying in my family. Thou who art undead art chosen. In thine exodus from the undead asylum, maketh pilgrimage to the land of ancient lords. When thou ringeth the bell of awakening, the fate of the undead thou shalt know. Well, now you know. And I can die with hope in my heart. Oh, one more thing. Here, take Here, this. Take this. An Estus flask. An, an undead undead favorite. <gasps> oh, and, and this. this. Um, no, yeah, goodbye. Uh, what I wanted to say is, um... Oscar, I read that, was originally planned to be like your Gary Oak, who is like your friendly rival and uh, who will eventually have the complete opposite goal of you in the end, which I will explain later on why that is, uh, why there are two goals that you can fulfill, but let us get to that plot point first. And now I can actually backstab, which is awesome. Gives me so much power. Look at this! Boom! Hit him with the club. And... Boom! Again. Oh, I love this animation. Chuck the Estus. And now it gets awesome. I am the naked man, and I am here to kill you. Hasha! Look at this damage. Mmm. GG. Come on. And the pilgrim key, so I can open the door. Hey, stray demon! Why does the chicken cross the road? Not again! To get to the fat fuck's house. Why are you asking me this? And we head off. <sighs> we head off, guys. Into the realm of Lordran. Again! So, we're gonna skip this. If you want to see the longer version of this, l l watch through the first two episodes of my Knight of the Shield. It's easier, e easier this way. Easier this way. Um, let's talk well, to him. Let me get, but there's no, uh, there are two bells of awakening, one, one in the other church, and the other in Blight Tower. Something happened. Not much to go on. So, help me. <laughs> Fuck you, oh, crestfallen. <laughs> Alright, I'm still hollow. Uh, where's my humanity? Use item. Reverse hollowing, yes. It's funnier that way, if we get invaders early and stuff. So, I'm the naked man. Level up. So I'm thinking about what build I will play, and I will not play. Or will I play an agility build or a more tanky one? I will actually play. Pff. 
agility or tank. I could play Fencer again. It's actually quite fun, but gets hard later on. And I don't know if I can solo um, our friend, the idiot. Uh, no, I will take. I will play both actually. I will um, do spear. Spear behind the shield. Looks awesome. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's well. Listen, one of the bells is up. up. You have the to climb church. the stairs up the ruin. The other bell is back down below the within the play. But I die again before I step. <laughs> uh, what people often Lucky do, hell, by the way. You are. Uh, you asked too many questions. Mm -hmm. I'm not up. Okay. Um. The thing many people do is running towards the cemetery, and I did the same thing, but in theory, if you're intelligent enough to speak to everybody, you know where to go, and uh, that's how I found out that I had to go back to the Undead Asylum, uh, because the Crestfallen Warrior observes the whole area and gives you tips where you Hello have to there. go next. I believe and we are not... I am Petrus. If not, I prefer... I want to learn your miracles, motherfucker. Hello there. But I also want you to know... Here. No, go ahead. Thank you for your copper coin. I don't oh need my. that. You... Oh, I know. I have to await... So what if I were to teach... Would that please? Yeah. Very I well. want to learn your miracles. Then first, a covenant with... Yes. Give me your miracles. For the way of the white, who are now let me share my miracles. Only their ultimate effectiveness will be determined by your efforts and your faith. See, you can get the miracles here. You need a talisman to cast them, and if you use miracles, those are like right now the ones that are uh, the helpful ones. Where I would say it's more like priest, cleric stuff, healing, well, force not so much, but you can teleport back and seek guidance to get tips. The effectiveness it's cool. of the teachings depend upon me. But the way of white, yeah, the way of white is a covenant that uh, is in the face of uh, faith of Lord Gwyn, who is uh, the dude responsible for all them that's coming here, so we can link the uh, first flame and kindle it uh, so the age of the gods and the age of the light is uh, postponed you know what I mean um, the eye orbs I need to get uh, them if I want to PvP Morningstar is a good weapon for bleeding effects and the homeward bone which I need to teleport back um What's this? The Lloyd's Talisman that attracts other enemies. I try to not die here horribly. Large soul of the undead. Fuck you. Running around. The naked man runs again, guys. Stop him if you can! Stop him! You cannot. That is Curse of the Undead. Not being able to stalk naked man, that is the true purpose of being undead. Uh, let's just roll. Let's just block that. Come on. Oh, fuck you! That was much stupidity. Why didn't I go back? That's like, ah, uh, fuck. Well, didn't lose anything. Just going back, getting the few swords back. And that is one humanity down the shitter, which I didn't want to do. Ah. Uh, well, it's talking and playing. Like, okay, I didn't talk that much, but if you talk and play, you automatically play worse. But who cares? Was just the first dead death. 
Ähm Again, we try to stay in human form as long as possible. First Holloway, yes. And this time, this whole thing will go so much faster. Five minutes left, so I can get up there, kill the undead, get through the first bonfire. One episode, asylum and bonfire. Are you shitting me? The naked man is coming. Stop it. And bang. Scrubs learn to play. Hop, getting here, grabbing this. How often did I play this part already? Pfft. Six times. Seriously. Jump over here. Getting up there. Man, those steps. It's like it was five minutes ago. Not even. Getting his soul. Getting back in there. Killing the red. One, two. Getting his soul. It's the, the first ten minutes of the game are like... But after that, we can go and kill a few hundred. Right, guys? I'm gonna do this like men. Bang, bang. Bang, and bang. I say bang, 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 and bang. Bang, bang. Those bombs will get in handy when we fight the Taurus Demon. And yes, I will beat the Taurus Demon cheap way. Cheap way. Yay. I don't even know if it's the cheap way because, like, they give you the bombs in so much capacity. Drink the esters. I'm playing not careful at all here. Um. Rubbish. Do not hit me! I hit you! I have a club, which I will use against you. Climb the ladders. Climb the ladders. I don't actually know why, except for the one death, which was sheer stupidity, because I went to the cemetery, but I wanted to have the soul. Uh, I don't really know why people say the, um, the Deprived is the hardest class. I think the Deprived is one of the easiest if you have never played the game before because for example the, the thief with his just with his knife is in my opinion way harder because of the sole fact that he is based around backstabbing and you don't know the backstab mechanics that well if you start. Hello dragon! Hi dragon! Lure the gnome here. Ouch! Like, I have a targeting option and I miss <laughs> still. So, let's run up there. Hit him. Get everything we want. The wooden shield. Equip the wooden shield. See how fast this is going. It's like... Give me the fucking two shields and it takes... 
so fucking long. Bang. Like, I one-shot everything. It's so ridiculous. Take him out. We're at 20 minutes now. We are going to buy from well, him. <laughs> Purchase. Does he have a spear already? I want to have an early spear. Yes, he has. 600 souls. Why not? Wait, wait, wait. Let's get the heater shield. <laughs> if I learned one thing, <laughs> let's get the heater shield first. The spear is not important, the spear is a drop. But the heater shield. Oh shit, man. Oh shit, that heater shield. Okay, let's get those last hollows. Get the item. Oh, I get <laughs> myself killed. Whatever. And after we're. Uh, after we've killed them, we are going to climb up here. By the way, still waiting for other gimmicks I can play that won't take forever. Uh, but doesn't really matter in the end, because I think I will base this channel around playing harder games instead of the gimmicks. I would like to play gimmicks, but gimmicks take so much time. And if I can do this... Uh, like, I will try to do as many gimmick episodes as I can, but mm, it's really hard, it's really time consuming. And I also will start now with the podcasting thing, because uh, one thing that annoys me so much about having free time so, uh, at the moment, because my job is like, I have to work three to four days a week, and the other two are just sitting around at home, writing applications and stuff. Um, the most boring part is when I don't have anything to listen to. So I will basically uh, start that podcast thing so other people can enjoy what I enjoy most about my free time sometimes. Yeah, of course, except for playing games. I, it, it, it should be like a medium that you can play games while you're doing my podcasty thing, listening to. I will try to do them uh, two a week. Maybe three, depending on how much time uh, I can uh, afford to put in that. But yeah, I'm just using my swords. Why the fuck did I <laughs> de-equip my uh, my club? I don't know. Level myself up in strength once and I will buy a few bombs next episode so we can hit the Taurus demon half. So I hope you enjoyed my first episode and um, yeah more will come quickly like I hope I can upload them daily because it goes way faster without the cutting. Um, yeah hope to see you next episode on my Dark Tools normal run and hope you have a great day. Goodbye!